Hey YouTube, welcome back to another video on Desmond Shaheen's channel. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you check out my TikTok below to check out the workout techniques on our TikTok page. And like, comment, and subscribe on our TikTok page. Let's get into this workout. So we're going to start off with um, stretching and we're going to move into arms, abs, and glutes. So we're going to level up so we're going to start off with stretching we're going to do triceps so we're going to start off reaching from the sky to the side and let's get back okay we're going to reach to the sky and then we're going to or reach to the ceiling and then we're going to bend the elbow placing hand on the back of neck with other hand grab elbow and then pull back gently to one hand ready go 10 second hold. Moving on. Other side, go. Moving on to wrist and forearm. We're going to stick out each arm. With the other arm, we're going to start off with the left hand stretching with our left hand. And then with the uh, dominant right arm. We're going to uh, have our palms like this on the right side. We're about to stretch. We're going to grab our fingers and we're going to pull them back to us. Hold for 10 seconds. Go. Feel the stretch in your fingers, wrists, and forearm. Moving on to the other side. Go. Then we're going to um, do the little press. It's still going. Okay, then we're moving on to neck roll. We're going to, without struggling our shoulders, we're going to lean your ear toward your shoulder. The left ear, I mean, the right ear, we're going to lean toward your shoulder. Then we're going to do the other side. Then we're going to drop chin to your chest. Then we're going to look up. Breathe in the nose, out the mouth. Then we're going to look to your left. Now everybody look to the right. Can you feel that? So we're moving on to pectorals. We're going to bare forearm on the wall and shoulder level. Basically, we're going to bend it back like that. So we're going to take it. I'm going to uh, move my camera out this way so you can see more. So take your arm, step out, sit, go. 10 seconds. Definitely feel that. Other side, go. Go. Okay. Definitely feel that in the pectorials. And then we're going to move on to quad stretch, uh, stretch for most gains. Keep your knees together and pull as close to your glute. As possible, going on to the wall, 10 seconds go. Moving on to the other leg. And then now we're going to calf muscles going towards the wall. Step back with our dominant foot, we're stretching. And then other leg, same thing. So right leg at a 90 degree. The left leg is step back. We're stretching out that leg and step back. Go. Well. 
to figure arms the last stretch. So hold uh put your heel on your knee and then use your fingers to pull this leg back. Whoops. And then hold for 10. Release rest the knee in place. Then we're going to do that again, but this time with the other leg, pull that leg in, push that other leg out if you need to, that's stretch. 10 seconds to go. Okay, good job. <laughs> so we're moving on to arms. So we're going to do uh, forearm plank. We're going to bend at elbows at a 90 degree in kneeling position. And we're going to lean forward until elbows and forearm are on the ground. And extend your legs full. Keep that straight in line by flexing your core muscles. So when you flex your core muscles, you must flex that stomach in. Keep that spine aligned. Go. Rise up, moving on to the next exercise, and it's going to be a reverse plank. This time, it's going to work on our shoulders and arm while also targeting targeting the lower body muscles, looks like the glutes, hamstring, core, lower back, and hip flexors. You're going to sit on the floor with legs straight out in front of you. Place both hands on the floor and sit behind you. Just work and sit behind your back. And you're going to push through your palm. So ready? Three, two, one, start. Ten second hold. Don't stop. Relax. Good job. And then we're going to do push ups. We're going to do three push ups. Then we're going to do um, lateral plank walk. So we're going to stay in a plank position. We're just going to walk as one breath. Ready? Three, two, And shoulder width apart. Good job. Then last one, we're going to stay. We should have stayed in that plank position, but we're gonna take a 30 second break. Then we're gonna move on to inch rolls for shoulder pads. So 30 second break, go. Give yourself a stretch, drink some water, and then put your nose out with your mouth. Then we're going to move on to abs. Have 10 more seconds for our break. So we're going to start off by lying on our back, keeping your arms up over your head, and then um, your legs extended. And then we're going to do 10 reps of jackknife sit ups. <laughs> Four, Whew. 
Then we're going to do mountain kindness. We're going to go knee to elbow in that plank position. Then we're going to, I got to take a break. I got to take a two second break. Then we're doing oblique crunch. That's standing oblique, oblique crunch. Well, like I said, with mountain climbers, need to elbow. Okay, we're moving right through this list. Slowly and easy. We're moving on to the last uh, exercise of the day, but we're, with this one is glutes. We're not going to do too much of glutes because I do have group workouts and group techniques. We have group workouts, group techniques. Try out my husband's techniques on our TikTok page, it's down below. So, like I said, we're just going to do some simple group bridges, single leg group bridges. And then um, that's pretty much it. Because, you know, I've always liked having toned arms, toned abs, you know, more so of my butt. You know, having a big butt is too much. So, like I said, we're doing group bridges, nice little group bridges, and then we'll be done. Okay, 10. Moving on to single. You can alternate it to keep those glutes in the air. Guys, good workout. Thank you for watching my in shape camera. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe on my YouTube channel and my YouTube videos. And check out our TikTok. See ya.